Hey, Brian Sucker here again, certified personal trainer and baby boomer fitness expert, where today I'm gonna to talk about core exercises for men over the age of 60. So the importance of uh, training your core is uh, it's going to help you have good functional strength. It's going to prevent you from having um, any injuries of, of, of back pain, but it's also going to uh, translate to your day-to-day -day life to make sure that you're doing a lot of um, your daily activities without uh, having a lot of uh, worries about getting strain tears pull. So um, a lot of times guys are asking me, so you know, I need to strengthen my core. I'm noticing this when I go, you know, pick up some some groceries or they head down to Home Depot and they're or they're doing things out in their yard where they're working. So uh, when you when you want to strengthen your core. Uh, like always, I talk about you want to strengthen your big lifts first. You want to work on your squats, you want to work on your deadlifts, uh, overhead, overhead pressing mo movements, and then pull-ups. Uh, the reason why you want to focus on them because you're going to be utilizing your core more than you would in any other isolation uh, type movements. Then you're going to start working on some hit style functional training movements, which would be things like battle ropes, uh, sled pushes, roll machines, and if you can, and you're in your 60s, um, sprints and that's one exercise that I would tell you to work on long term because that's going to translate translate over longevity but also quality of life as you age. Now let's talk about some basic uh, core uh, exercise that you can start applying for yourself. You want to think of your core in four major regions. You got your lower abs, you got your sides, you got your upper abs and then you've got your back. So one of the best exercises that you could do for uh, your lower abs is any kind of leg lifting exercise. So one that you can do is just going to uh, lie flat on the floor. Your back's going to be flat. Slight bend in your knees. You're going to lift your legs up. Deep breath in and then exhale. You can do these from a hanging position. You can do these from a lying position. Or if you have a Roman chair in your gym, you can do one from there. Uh, the next one, you can that's for your lower. One for your upper abs, you're just going to have your legs straight, hands behind your head, you're going to reach up, squeeze, and then back. And then breathing out, <sighs> working through that, 15 to 20 reps. Another great exercise for your upper abs is the wheel. So what you're going to do is you've got a wheel like so, and what you're going to do is you're, you're going to keep your chest tall, you're going to extend uh, straight out, keep that chest tall, squeeze your glutes, and then pull back in. It's a great exercise for helping... Um, Strengthen the top of your core, but also prevent you from having back pain, and it's going to help you have good posture. Something that's starting to happen as you age is your posture starts to uh, decrease, so it's going to help you, you know, translate over to having better posture. So chest tall, belly button in, and then back. Great exercise for your side is the Paloff press. We got our uh, machine over here, when you just, and what you're going to do is you're going to stand about arm length away from the machine. You're going to drive straight out, breathe out, deep breath in, and then back. We're going to do 15 to 20 repetitions, and then you'll turn and you'll do the other side. So that way you stay balanced on uh, both sides right there. And then the last one you can do are glute bridges. You can do them from a mat, or you can do them from a bench to increase the intensity. So your back's flat, hands on your thighs, you drive your hips up, back down under control. And then the last one is a plank. So your back's flat, hold yourself in a push-up position, breathing out, <sighs> belly button in. All right, so those are the most effective core exercises you do for men over the age of 60. Remember, work on those big lifts, work on the hit style cardio, and incorporate some of these more isolation movements, and you're gonna have a better quality of life, you're gonna have better functional fitness, better aging, and you're gonna have less uh, back pain, strain tears, pull. I look forward to talking to you soon.